Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back on Yu-Gi-Oh! Legacy of the Duelist. We're going to be doing the Arena of Souls, which I believe is the DLC, um, not mission, but DLC duel that I got for buying this first one. I'm probably going to end up buying all of them because um, that's only, what, 20 bucks, 20 more bucks, and that's really not that much, not that bad. Because um, I'll probably end up playing this game a decent amount. It's something quick that I can do. You know, um, I like to get up in the morning before I go to work or school, and I like to, you know, kind of wake up and do something. This could actually be something I could do in the morning, play a quick duel or something for fun. Uh, also something I can do when I'm taking a break from homework. It's something quick and something that gives me a nice little break. So I uh, might actually be playing this a lot more than I was expecting to. Because uh, it's actually pretty fun. And uh, with all five of the the arcs, like the, the, the anime series, that's a lot of cards and a lot of different stuff to do. But Joey huffed and puffed as he ran in fear. He took a quick glance behind him to see Kaiba's blue eyes white dragon barreling down on him. Blue Eyes was about to make a snack out of Joey when Joey woke up from his nightmare. A dream. Phew. Kaiba will see who eats the dog chow on this island. Everybody wake up. Joey, what's wrong? Nothing's wrong. It's a brand new day of the tournament, and I'm hot to find us a duel. Well, you don't have to yell about it. Hey, guys, what's all the commotion? Good morning, Taya. Where's Mai? Isn't she with you? She said she had to go, and to give you this note, Yugi. The note said that Mai borrowed eight of Yugi's star chips. Well, you can kiss those star chips goodbye. I don't know, maybe we really can trust Mai. And if not, we're still the Team Supreme, right? Right. Okay then, move out. I wonder how many duelists are left on the island. They shipped a couple dozen home yesterday, and I bet even more have been eliminated by now. And some of them were really good players with powerful cards. We could be next. Not a chance, Yug. The, those other guys just wanted the prize. You and Joey have a lot more at stake. That's true. I gotta rescue Grandpa from Pegasus, and Joey needs the prize money to help his sister. The duelists we face today will be even stronger because they survived the first round. Even stronger? Careful what you say, Yugi. You, you've got little Joey here shaking in his sneakers. What? You think I'm a scared little puppy dog? Well, if the collar fits. Alright, break it up. You just bring on in any duelist and I'll cream them. Right, you gotta believe in yourself, Joey. God, this is a ton of reading. I need to take a break from playing this game and just play another game so I don't have to all read. Right, you gotta believe in yourself, Joey. Little did they know that they were being watched by one of Bandicoot's cronies, bon Bones. <laughs> I said Bonds. Bones. We found two duelists. One is just a stupid git, but the other one is a good duelist. His name is Yugi. He's the kid who beat Kaiba. Everyone figures him to make it all the way to Pegasus' castle. Yugi, huh? Yeah, I've heard of him. He's supposed to be t a tough little squirt, that is, if you believe his reputation. Yeah, we've never seen him duel. How do we know how good Yugi really is? Nobody is going to the castle except us. That's why I teamed up with the most brilliant duelist on the whole island. That's right, so if you want to win this tournament, you'll keep cool and let Bandit Keith do the thinking for you. Thinking of him, thinking to himself, you hear me, Pegasus? Soon it'll be payback time. Thinking to himself, uh, I'm not gonna read that. He's thinking to himself, okay, with this dialogue. Payback for the way you humiliated me at the duel, duel master, duel ma, god. See, the more reading I do, the worse it gets. Reading out loud is not my strong suit. Okay. Payback for the way you humiliated me at the duel monsters intercontinental championship. It all came down to you against me, and I had you right where I wanted you. I was sure I was about to win, but you just scribbled some note and called over a kid from the audience to duel in your place. Hey, what are you doing? Asking for help is illegal. I don't need help. A child could defeat you, Bandit Keith, and I'm going to prove it. Pegasus handed the note to the child. Just follow these instructions and you'll win. I didn't know what to make of it. Were you just trying to psych me out, or did you chicken out? Either way, it was fine by me so long as I took home the prize money. After Bandit Keith played a card, the child looked at the note, followed the instructions, and took out the rest of Bandit Keith's life points. What, you little snot-nosed brat? There's no way you could have known I was going to play that card. Bandit Keith snatched the note from the child's hand. Give me that! It's all here. The card I play. How to beat it. Everything. No! You may have defeated me, Pegasus, but you cheated me. Nobody makes a fool out of Bandit Keith. You said you found two duelists? Yeah, Yugi and some dweeb named Joey. Good, we'll take the dweeb out first. Did you hear that? I think we're being followed. I think you're getting a little paranoid, Joey. 
You've been acting hyper ever since you woke up this morning. What the heck is eating you anyway? That's just a weird way to put that. I'm telling you, somebody's stalking us. Joy ran off into the woods. Where are you going to stalk them? As Joey wandered through the woods, he thought he heard something behind him. Suddenly, Joey's whole world turned to black as he was knocked unconscious. The next thing you know, he woke up inside a cave. What is this place? Welcome to the arena of lost souls. Abandoned hope. For no duelist gets out alive. Prepare for your final duel. This arena will be your graveyard. This is... Like... The ghosts of the dead are all around you, Joey. There's no way to escape from your fear. Huh? Who says I'm scared? You can't hide the truth from the spirits, Joey. They see you frozen in fear. Okay, I was afraid, but not because of the graveyard or your ooga booga rap. It's your creepy face that gives me the that gave me the willies. Grr, lay down your star chips now. Hey, I never even agreed to this duel. Tough luck, you haven't got any choice, dweeb. There has to be some way out of this. You want a way out? Well then hand over all your star chips and crawl off like a little like a scared little puppy dog. Joey remembered his nightmare involving Kaiba and came to a realization. If I run from this, I really will be a scared little puppy dog, so I'll just have to beat ya. Four star chips. Let's duel. Oh my god, I need a drink of my cherry coke, dude. That's a... That was just a ton of reading. Can I finally win one of these? Rock. Yeah, we won! I'm going second. <sighs> dude, that's so much reading. So much reading. That was like, what was that, six minutes of reading? Oh, yeah, what the heck kind of a hand is this? Dude, now I gotta duel with Joey's trash cards. Man. What card do I need to summon Flame Swordsman? Masa oh, I have them. I have both of them to summon Flame Swordsman. I just don't have... Oh, this is gonna be horrible, dude. This is literally gonna be horrible. I ain't got anything to beat anything with. It's gonna come down to a time wizard, I almost feel. Oh, good, a stop defense. Beautiful, thank you. Oh, great. Oh, great. Pumpkin King of Ghosts. Oh, call it the haunted. Oh, this is not good. F me, dude. F me. Well. Well, this, this is horrible. Oh, what does this thing do? Kojikosi. Kojikosi. Um, yep, yep, I'm going for it. I'm going for it. If I fail this, I'm probably gonna lose. Yep, I'm calling the gold side again. Oh, God. Well, well, that's pretty much GG. I gotta draw Flame Swordsman, or I, I gotta... No, see, Flame Swordsman's not even strong enough. His stupid pumpkin will just kill me. It will just trade, and that's just not a good situation, dude. Dude, we are so dead. We are so dead. Woo, baby dragon. That's not a big old piece of crap. Well, this is the only option I have at this moment. Dude, I'm so gonna lose. I'm so gonna lose. Oh, yep, this is GG. This is GG, yeah, summon another monster and GG. Oh, what did he just summon? Oh my gosh, dude. 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 Joey, your deck is some trash, man. Your deck is some legit just trash. Bro. Bro. Bro, dude, that is just... That is just some pathetic. Oh my gosh, Joey, your deck is some trash. That deck is just horrible. Hey, I won again. Bones just sucks at picking heads or tails. Alright. Please give me a better hand. The Joey's. Oh my gosh, dude. I guess X-Rayer is better, but this is horrible. Okay, well, we're going with X-Rayer. And I'm gonna set Kunai with Chain, and I'm gonna set a Dust Tornado. 
Okay. Well, activator attack. Of course! Oh, for freaking course! It's a castle of dark illusions, and I can't do anything about that. Son of dirt. This is annoying. I cannot lose Axe Raider, so I have to do this. I have to give him the attack points. So he's got 2200 now. Oh, what's he bringing out? What's he bring? Okay, Vampire Dragon, dude. Dude. Well, suck on this. Stupid vampire piece of crap. I'm playing with 1100 attack point monster, dude. This is a joke. I lost my axe raider. Like, I'm in some serious trouble, and he just got a mon He got zombie mammoth, which clearly had more attack points than 1100. Dude, Joey, your deck is such ass cheeks, man. Uh, it is just some... Dookie BS. Oh my gosh, dude. Uh, no. I don't know what's going on. Oh. Oh, good. Oh, okay. Okay, that works. I'll, ta I'll take that. Can I please draw anything? Something. Okay, Tiger X. I can work with Tiger X. Not really. Okay, so he's gonna do 2400 da- okay, I'm going to... I'm gonna eat the damage. Whatever damage he wants to do, I'm gonna eat it, and I'm gonna dark hole next turn. I think that's the best bet. Yay, zombie master. So I'm gonna lose 4200. Okay, well I still got 2000 light points left. I'm gonna destroy this, because I don't know what it is. Out oh, was a call of the haunted. I'll set that. Come on, give me something, game. Something I can work with. Okay. I guess this will work. Dark hole. Yeah, goodbye. Tiger eggs. Okay, this is actually a semi-close duel, not really. He's kicking my butt. But I've just had some decent cards. Okay, hold on, what is Kunai with Chain's effect? Opponent to the target the... Okay, okay, I need to just wait until he goes for an attack. Yep, here he goes, he's going for it! He's going for it! No, I want him to attack. Yes, there we go. Kunai with chain. Both effects. Tiger X. Okay, can I draw a monster, please? Thank you. Battle Warrior is such trash, dude. These monsters are just horrible. If I actually end up beating him, this is just a joke. Oh my gosh. What? I already know what's gonna happen. I'm gonna get to do a direct attack next turn. But, I'm gonna get screwed, because I won't be able to do enough damage. Look at this, this is actually a pretty close duel. And then I draw a card that requires a sacrifice, and I don't have anything to sacrifice. Dude. It wouldn't benefit me any to summon Battle Steer. He's got the same attack as Tiger Axe, and doesn't make any sense. Okay. He's just stalling until he can draw a call to haunt it. Yeah, Masaki. I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit. Risk it for the biscuit. Risk it. Masaki, no! Son of a gun, dude. He can't summon anything with 2,000 attack. Nothing with 2,000 attack hurts. GG. He drew a call to haunt it. It's GG. What? What is he doing? Oh gosh. Oh gosh, oh gosh, what is that defense? Please don't be Castle of Dark Illusions. No Castle of Dark Illusions. Please, Bones. No Castle of Dark Illusions. Don't do this to me. Don't do this to me, Bones. Yes! Victory! Yes! Yes, we beat Bones with this trash Joey deck. During the duel, Joey's friends found the game, found the cave and cheered him on to victory. All right, 
Joey, you won. You did it. I did, did didn't I? See you around, loser. But wait, boss. Barry Keith, maybe next time you'll have the nerve to duel me face to face instead of hiding behind your creepy flunkies. Duel you face to face? You're hopeless, dweeb. The game of Duel Monsters is all about keeping your opponent off balance. Winning the duel is all that matters, not how you go about it. We'll just see about that, Bandit Keith. Yeah, right, I'm quivering in fear already, dweeb. What a jerk. Guys, I'm really sorry, I didn't mean to drag you into this mess. Next time, don't be in such of a big hurry to run off on your own. Hey, it's, it's alright, we know that it wasn't your fault, Joey. Yeah, I mean, as long as he won the duel, we can forgive him. I admit, you had us worried at first. But you really came through this time. I got lucky, that's all. It wasn't luck, Joey, it was your determination, your trust in the cards, and the promise you made to your sister. That's what helped you win. I only need two more star chips. Hang in there, Serenity. So now, can we get onto this creepy pit? Oh, out of this creepy pit, I think is what it said. You bet, nothing is gonna stop us now. Alright, so Arena of Lost Souls, Bones Deck Avatar, Bones Rise of the Zombies Deck Recipe, Bones Armageddon deck challenge, or deck, yeah, challenge deck. Uh, signature card, Pump King, Graveyard, and the Hand of Invitation, uh, Zanki, and Victory Duel Points. Okay, so it's time for Face Off. I really like this duel. Uh, oh, I get to be Kaiba, too. While Yugi's team worked their way through the tournament, our history now turns to Seto Kaiba for a moment. As you remember, Seto had only been defeated in Duel Monsters once by Yugi. Seto had a little brother named Mokuba. Pegasus kidnapped Mokuba and locked him in a dungeon to lure Seto into a trap. And it worked. As Seto made his way to the dungeon to save his brother, Pegasus spung, sprung the trap and stole Mokuba's soul, just, he, just as he had Yugi's grandfather. Seto Kaiba, do you care enough about your brother's life to try and save his soul? Grr, you're not human. Quite human, actually, just extraordinarily gifted. Pegasus threw a handful of star chips at Kaiba. Here, you'll need these for your duel with Yugi. Why are you doing this? My reasons are none of your concern. Maybe I just enjoy the struggle, watching the constant tug-of-war between you and Yugi, boy. Or maybe I want something you're incapable of comprehending. Talk straight, what do you want? Want? I want to see if you're capable of defeating little Yugi in a duel, and only if you successfully crush him in a humiliating defeat will you get the opportunity to duel me. Then, if you beat me, I promise to restore your brother's soul. For now, I have no choice but to play your game, but as soon as I defeat Yugi, I'll be back. And you'd better make good on your promise to restore my brother, because if you don't, I'll take great pleasure in separating your soul from your body in my own way. And with that, Pegasus had another duelist under his control to take down Yugi. Yugi and I both have enough star chips to get into the castle now, isn't that right, Yug? Yeah, finally. Grandpa, here I come. Hey guys, look, you're not gonna believe who's blocking our way into the castle. It's Kaiba. I can't let you pass, Yugi. I've won ten star chips, so stand aside. You may have won enough star chips to qualify for the Duelist King to play us, but I can't allow you to face Pegasus. He's mine. You and I are going to have one final duel, Yugi. I'm not dueling you, I don't have to. So no longer confident that your so-called heart of the cards can help you win, you're just afraid you can't beat me a second time, you coward. Back off, he doesn't have to prove anything. Yuki, you said you won by tapping into the heart of the cards, and for a long time, I didn't know what that meant. But now I think I do, and it took Pegasus to show me. He gave me a reason to put my heart in the cards. For the first time, I can duel with fire and passion in my heart. Yuki, you can't accept this duel. I've changed, I deserve a rematch. Give me a chance to play you now, Yuki, let me play you for the right reasons. Kaiba, I accept your duel. We'll see what, you, what you've what you really learned. Alright, time to kick Yugi's butt with Kaiba's deck. Here we go. Here we go! Oh, can I summon Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon? This is a... This is a... This is a question that I have. Can I actually summon this here? I better be able to. I have one card in my extra deck. Um, ooh, ooh. All monsters they control. If you do, destroy the monsters among them with 1,500 or more attack. Then your opponent can destroy up to three monsters with 1,500 or more attack in their deck. I think it. I think it may be crush card virus time. 
Oh, we do have Blue Eyes Ultimate. I gotta summon Blue Eyes Ultimate. Like, that just needs to happen. Also need to get... Also need to play some Crush Card Virus. The Eye of Truth. Okay. Opponent must show his or her hand. Okay. I didn't get to finish reading that. Ha ha ha! You can't destroy my wall of illusion. Okay, good. Battle Ox. Okay, so I get a thousand life points. What does this do? Your opponent increases his or her life points 1,000 points during each of his or her standby. If he or she has a spell card in his, in his or her hand. Okay, so as long as I have keep the stupid Fusion Sage card in my hand. Crush card. Set Crush card. Um, I think I'm going to summon Battle Ox. If only Wall of Illusion had 950. Dang it, I can't kill this dude. Oh gosh, I can't even kill it with Sword Stalker. What the heck am I supposed to do here? I gotta draw blue eyes. What card could I activate? Oh, I could act. Alright, Yugi, say goodbye to your hand. Oh, he doesn't have a. Oh my god, he doesn't have anything. Of oh, you have got to be. Oh, well, I know his hand now. I know his hand now, that's good. Mini Guts? The heck is that? What the heck is that? What the... What the fuck was that? Never seen that card before in my life. Yeah, thanks for the life points. A dragon commonly... F okay, so he still only has 1400. So Ryu Kishin Powder. Power. Ah, po no, it's powered. Okay, I was right. Okay, I'm gonna bring my Battle Ox back. Give me my- no, 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 Battle Ox. Give me my Battle Ox back. I know you don't have anything good in your hand, Yugi. So one good thing about using- that Crush card did me no good, except I got to see that he has nothing in his hand. Oh, he's got something face down. Like, probably Magic Cylinder. What is it? Wait, what? Why did that do no damage? Oh, because I think I did Crush Card. I think Crush Card made it so I don't do any damage. Was that it? I don't even know what it was. Ancient Land? Okay, I, well, I don't have the means to special summon Lajian, so... He's not in my hand, so doesn't he- Oh my gosh, another card I can't- Oh my god, dude. This is annoying, man. He's got all these stupid cards with 2,000 defense, and I have the Sword Soccer in my hand, but it does me no good because he can't deal that much damage. Ah, <sighs> give me my blue eyes. Give me something, dude. Oh my god. Oh, this actually will work out well. When this card is sent to the graveyard, add one blue eyes white dragon from your hand, from your deck to your hand. All right, this will work. I'll make him destroy it, but that'll get me a blue eyes in my hand. I kind of want to summon blue eyes ultimate dragon just for the just for the fun of it. But I have a feeling as soon as I do that, he'd get a mirror force or something on the field, and oh well, there it is. GG. Yes, thank you. Destroy my White Stone of Legend. Yes, let's bring a blue eyes to my hand. Thank you, Yugi. You idiot. Hey, another White Stone of Legend. Well, isn't this just peachy? Thank you. I really want to summon it, but I know I'm probably going to end up getting Mirror Forced. Okay, getting him down lower in health. I got a polymerization to set on the field. Come on, I want this blue eyes ultimate dragon. Yeah, keep summoning stuff and killing my, killing my crap. Yeah, one more blue eyes. Can I draw it out, dude? Twenty-seven, one in a twenty-seven. I actually, it's two in twenty-seven chance. Because I could just draw another one. At, aw, aw, the spell. Um, 
I don't know what he has over there. I want to see what it is. What is it? Oh, multiply. Okay, kind of happy I actually did flip that. Okay, I guess I'm going to summon Sword Stalker because there's not a reason not to at this moment. We're summoning Blue Eyes Ultimate. I'm saying YOLO. We're going to we're going to wait. I'm going to summon it. All right. I've got him pretty low on life points. If I could get him to 50 life points, that'd be beautiful. That'd be really easy to take him out. Okay, or he can play Swords of Revealing Light, so I can't do anything. Summoner's Art. What does this do? Add one luck. Thank you. I'll take that, Blue Eyes. So now I'm just gonna wait, because I'm not gonna play it. I want him to do something stupid, like play Mirror Force or something like that. Nope, he's just gonna end his turn. Oh hey look, it's another polymerization. Isn't that cute? Look at all the life points I have, dude. Even if I can't, uh, even if I don't beat him with Blue Eyes Ultimate, I'll still get the win because I have so many life points. What did I draw this time? Ooh, another Ryu Cushion Power. I don't get the point of that. Like, what does that card even do? All I'm seeing is it giving me free life points. Yeah. Oh, I must show my hand. So he sees my hand every turn. So he knows I'm gonna summon Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon and wreck his face. Oh no. Oh no. What is that? Hey, look, it's Legion. Okay, well, I'm gonna make sure that's not Mirror Force. It's not Mirror Force, okay. I'm gonna do this just so I can further... Okay, scapegoat, oh, of course. Like, really, Yugi? You gotta do... You gotta be like this? So he needs to get a Mirror Force going here. That's what I'm trying to draw out. I want to get his stupid Mirror Force done and over with. Come on! What is he doing? Oh no. Oh, I missed my Sword Stalker, dude. You know what? Screw it. Screw it. I'm summoning Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. F it, dude. Give me it. Yeah! Let's go. Let's go. Yes. Yes. Got that blue eyes ultimate dragon, baby. Okay, I'm gonna keep Sagi and Lejin just in case. Just in case something. I don't know, there's nothing that can happen. I, I have to finish him off with blue eyes ultimate. No! He's got a Karibo in his hand. Are you kidding me, man? I can't believe it. Oh, well, there it is. GG. I gotta play Sagi. I gotta play... I gotta get Sagi out here. Yeah! I'm gonna tag with Sagi for fun. Yeah, Sagi. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's just finish it with Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. There we go. Victory. Yugi refused to finish his attack against Kaiba because he would have inflicted physical harm. When Yugi refused to attack, Kaiba struck and took the victory. I can't believe it. That underhanded sleazeball wiped Yugi out. I'm sorry about your grandpa, but you did the right thing. You would have had to hurt Kaiba, and I know your grandpa wouldn't, wouldn't want to be saved that way. Then I guess he got what he wanted. If Yugi had done what needed to be done, he would be entering the castle, not me. But he was too weak to follow through on his play. Pegasus' plan had worked to perfection. Good job, Kaiba boy. As you wish, I will be your next opponent. Little Yugi didn't fare nearly so well in his rematch. His spirit is broken, and his grandfather's soul remains mine. Ha 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 ha. Okay, new campaign duel unlocked. A duel of tears. Uh, the face-off uh, reverse duel. Uh, new deck avatar Yami Yugi. Karibo power deck recipe. Signature card Karibo. Horn of the Unicorn. Beaver Warrior. And some duel points. Okay, so now it's time for a duel of tears. Um, actually, I'm going to call it an episode for now, guys. I hope you all enjoyed, and then the next one we'll be doing uh, a duel of tears. So I'll catch you guys.